And this is Dan Kaiser, and we're going to be um, doing a tour of Enchanted Hills Camp for the Blind. Um, and in the background, you could probably see the dining room. And then I'm going to show you my cabin that I stayed in. These are like lakeside cabins, and there's about 11 of them all together. And so I'm going to um, gradually walk around and show everything. We're going to walk down to the... Um, we're going to walk down to the lower camp, but first um, show you, this is the dining room. This is the Hello. Hi. Who's that? Joanne. And there's the camp bell. In the dining room, I'll show you the dining room. I can find the door. Oh no, you're going, you're going too far, Pat. You're going to find the front door and went by the nurse's station. Yeah. Okay, you need to come this way. There's my, there's my roommate, Kelly, roommate, 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 Kelly Snow. <laughs> roommate. <laughs> Here's my doormat. No, that's, that's a, another capacity you serve. <laughs> there's a nurse's office, restrooms. We're walking down the main. And a um, real nice dining room. They're bussing the tables. And we're going to walk back out and go down what they call Cardiac Hill. And uh, what am I showing myself for? Going out, Camp Bell. And we are going to make our way. Now these cabins over here are the only ones that are air-conditioned. This, this, this is a pretty steep hill. And you see the guide ropes everywhere. They have guide ropes. Uh, 311 like acre. acres. And there's guide ropes probably around most of everything. And the camp is pretty much built on about 2,500 feet of downslope. And you see the what we call the Kiva, which is our, our music room, at the bottom of this hill. This is a steep hill. And there's another car coming up. You see all the guide ropes. He's going behind, underneath the cabins. And I'm going to shoot this hill when we get to the bottom. Show you how steep it is. Because it's pretty steep. All right. Then here's back to shooting up the hill. That is a steep hill. Hello. And you've just begun. You've got cardiac hill in front of you. Oh, I haven't even gone down it yet. Uh, you're at the bottom. That's what I said. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought oh, you, you thought I was up. going up? Yeah, yeah. No, I'm just. I was just doing a shot and a video from the bottom. Oh, okay. This is the Kiva. The Kiva. Where's the entrance? Oh, here it is. Uh, let me roll up to and open it for you. And it's just to my right. All right, thanks. Straight ahead. Uh -oh, Ken. Uh -oh. This is the the, ki the Kiva. The uh oh, here's the darts. And they're playing a bunch of blind people playing darts. Oh man. They do, it's called people driving and texting. And then if I go to the back door, there's a basketball court back here. Um, I'm going to get over here to the back door. And 
and um, at the free throw line there's a um, you can hit a buzzer step on this buzzer and up by the um, up by the rim of the basket um, it will buzz and then a couple times in the summer in the evenings they'll have bands play out here or play in here but then people stand out there too so let me get out of here get out of the way of the darts oh. My, I guess I'm going towards outdoors. No, we passed the door. Oh, right over here. here. No, come on, don't back up a little. Come towards my voice. Now walk straight. Over. Thank you very much. That's the kitchen door. You want to go past that? That's the wall. Go around it and then make a right. Thanks. Ah, that is really dangerous. You okay? Yeah, that, that's the uh, accident waiting to happen. <laughs> Won't be funny unless somebody breaks their leg. <laughs> and this camp is really built on like down about 2,200 feet, uh, sloping downwards. There's the uh, stables. A lawnmower. What kind of machine is that? A what? What does it do? Oh, cool. Can I drive it? <laughs> yeah, now it's too late. Yo, you timed that really good. Oh, yeah, for the ribs. I know. That's okay. I'll make up for it tomorrow. What what ra what do you mean? Are you, are you one of the radio announcers? No, I do that. I, do, I was going to do a show on the internet, and then I forgot the power cord to my mixer, oh. so I uh, I couldn't do it. But um, I've got some songs uh, to donate. I've got the entire Billboard Top 100 that I'm going to donate to the camp for from 1940 to the present. So I'm gonna I gotta give it to the right person. Jamie, I think. Okay, I didn't know who was and this is, I'm videotaping you. You're Tom, the, the uh, uh -huh. caretaker, right? Yeah. All right, see you later. And we're coming up to the swimming pool here. Where I think my dog is in the shade. So, if you were at the top and to come down, I think it's 2,500 feet on the slope. So everything is built in probably four or five layers, levels. This is one of the few places on, on, in the vineyard country where there's still a lot of trees. Everything has pretty much been chopped down for the orchards, I mean the uh, vineyards. It's kind of sad because there's some beautiful forests in here that only because it's a non-profit um, organization um, was it able to save a lot of this stuff. I'm going to walk with this over here. Off in that direction um, is sort of a 
slope and it there's um, sort of a new recreational area. Here's the pool area. Oh, did anybody take Pearson in the pool? Um, I can try. Most of the dogs aren't liking it. I got him in with a bone. Oh, okay. And the redwood circle is over here. Let's make sure I... This is a cathedral grove of redwoods. And if I aim the camera up, you can probably see how high these trees are. And this is really nice. This building is condemned, so I'm not about to go inside. There's a um, girls section off in that direction and a gazebo, um, but they look this pretty much the same as the cabins down here where the men, where the boys section is when they have the kids and the teens. And there's about, oh I don't know, six or seven of these wooden cabin structures with um, with uh, well they've got this plastic I don't know how well you, you could see these but there's bunks lockers um, there is a, a minimal electricity and a light bulb hanging down but they do the job cabins. Very, um, a lot of trees in this area. It's the bathroom. This bathroom is kind of amusing because, now is there a leak over here? Oh, let's see what's going on. Hello? Anybody in here? What is that noise? Let's see what's going on. Hello? Oh, that's a washroom. Okay. It's a washroom. Okay. Um, this was a cost overrun one year, and they had to... Um, they had to... Um, spend all the money by whatever July 30th or something and they built this uh, rather nice modern looking bathroom. And we are headed down. This is a part of the camp where nobody really goes unless you're going to one, in one direction or you're on an assisted hike. This is a, the canyon we were talking about is, is off in that direction and it goes for miles. This would be one of the areas where there's fire breaks, but I, they're probably not that super effective. <laughs> 